the icon has changed once again to a bandit. Yeah, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. I'm gonna actually go to bonus three first, because, uh, I think I'll probably need some extra stars for the- oh, this isn't the- no, this is not. <laughs> well, well. Yeah, you basically choose a card, and you can get the stuff on said card. Yeah, I... I yeah. <laughs> I didn't even read through that dialogue, because I was kind of stunned that this wasn't the one that I was thinking of, but... Drawing lots, get an item! Here's another chance to gain an item, flip a single card and receive the item shown, so... Just keep doing it until you get the item that you want. Well, that's not bad, actually. <laughs> I'm I'm kind of looking for stars though, so I might wanna I wanna do this a few times till I get that other plus ten there. Probably, maybe, might be. What if I should just keep picking the first one and maybe I'll get it eventually? <laughs> oh man, it's, it's, they're just messing with me now. I having both varieties of stars there. <laughs> All right, choose. I'm gonna choose the bottom left. Ah, I got chemicked. Oh, I should have picked the first one. Like I said, I did that to present I hate, hate luck based crapper zappers. <laughs> just, yeah. There's no skill to this. Just pick and guess until you get what you're looking for. <laughs> Because I, I think I only have that one plus ten, that's why... I, oh, come on. That's why I am uh, looking to get another sort of star, just in case I'm low on stars in the middle of... Extra, I should say by the end of Extra 3, because Extra 3 is kind of insane. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna keep picking this... No! This is the same, I'm gonna keep picking this first one. But no, 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 no. It just, just keeps failing me. I, I don't think we're ever gonna get off this bonus game at this. <laughs> but in any case, you can see that you can get stuff eventually from these bonus games, just not maybe from this particular bonus game. <laughs> like it, it could, it could be faster. Let's put it that way. I just can't believe that my luck is this horrendous. Oh come on, come on, not. It just seems like it's at the upper right corner a lot, though, like the stars, but I know it's all randomized, but... Yeah, I'm not, maybe I should just go to the upper right corner now. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, I'm done. I'm done. Extra three. Now, I actually said the name of this level earlier on. More Monkey Madness! But I said it in a different context. Yep, there's the Red Coin Shy Guys of Death. And it's gonna be... Headache and Deucey. <laughs> I mean, you get some stars at the beginning, so it, you're, just, you're just kinda there to kinda get you refilled and stuff, but... Well... Well... The, the, once we get into the actual acrobatic portion of this level, it's, it's all gonna go downhill. <laughs> You'll see what I mean. Oh, here we go. Because there's not a lot of surface area for you to do your movements and stuff like that. And you've also got these sort of move against the grain movement type dealios here that you gotta go, yeah, against. See, it's turning in this direction, but you want to go in the opposite direction, That which means you've got to go underneath it and to the bottomless pits. That is always a good thing. <laughs> I don't believe any of these posts that are, like, holding these carousels in place actually have anything, but... But you can never be too sure, I guess, maybe, but for just just for the sake of this first run, I am going to assume not. <laughs> a little red coin hidden up there, and I'm kinda of missing some of the lower red I mean let's just say lower coins. You know what I should do? Magnifying glass. Uh, yeah, you're gonna see red coins appear within the regular coins now much, much easier than the GBAs 
um, change red coin tell mechanics. Like before, oh shoot, oh shoot, no you don't! Oh, you damn, there's a flower up there. But yeah, see there's red coins now showing much, much better. See, in, in the SNES version, they all kind of show as a different color, all the red coins. So technically you don't really need the magnifying glass per se. But the thing about that is... Um, in the GBA version, they changed that, so not all the red coins are slightly different colors, like it was in the SNES version. <laughs> so, the magnifying- oof, I just wasn't holding up good enough. So yeah, the, since they changed that, it's kinda, kinda a little bit dicier to not use the magnifying glass, because you gotta make sure that you collect every coin that may or may not look suspicious. Which is what I've been doing. I know there's a red coin there, but there wasn't underneath here, right? Yeah, it was just that one over there. So I just, if I need to replay this level, I'll just keep pounding that post repeatedly. Alright. Yeah! And I hate these dangerous moves! <laughs> oh, Solo Toady! Solo Toady! Oh, dang you and your monkey madness! <laughs> I told you this level's hard. Oh yeah, I forgot there's a secret up here. That's actually important, isn't it? <laughs> well, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe it's just for the stars. I was just so focused on the monkey dodging that I completely forgot to jump high enough to get in here. <laughs> Needless to say, you can just stumble your way into this like I did here, but... Yeah, that's how you get more stars if you don't have your star items and... Okay. <laughs> Ah. Oh, I'm a little bit far ahead now. That's actually not... well... Uh, oh, shoot! No! No! Ah, it's too late. I'm too far below the platforms. I thought I was gonna land on the uh, carousel, but I didn't. But I didn't. So that up secret area was indeed an optional thing, so... Alright. <laughs> just, just good to know, I suppose. Because I can always use my stars to speed things along if need be. And I really gotta take care of that monkey after that backwards carousel. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't have to pound that one. Just this one, and only once. I'm just so used to pounding every sort of post that I see that repeating a level is, uh... It just feels out of the question at this moment in time. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and get that, and then I'll jump up here, just to get extra stars for kicks, because why not? You know, you, you could also push those crates at a much more easier to collect the star location, like closer to the center, before you bash it so that you don't have to collect them before they cook, fall off the edge or something like that. But, well, eh, eh, up to you. It's not really that big of a deal to just rush over and collect them. Anyway, let's go down, and now that we're on the other side... I think it's safe to... yeah, okay. Uh, boy. <laughs> yes! Alright, be careful. It's just that one shy... Ah, there's that one shy guy that is an incredible... Ah! Oh jeez! I wanted to suck him up and automatically go and... Oh! <laughs> I wanted to automatically go and... Um, swallow him, but I end up doing a ground pound, which the pla uh, platform saved me with. Alas. Alas. <laughs> okay. Alright, Monkey Madness. You may be one of the hardest stages around, but you don't stand a chance against my skills, eventually. <laughs> my skills are mostly about persistence. You cannot defeat someone who keeps coming back for more. <laughs> I know I can get this with an egg, but I'm just trying to save my eggs for stuff when I really need it. <laughs> oh, well. Okay, as long as I got rid of your watermelon, that is a decent victory, I suppose, on my part. <laughs> I really don't even have to hit that cloud up there, do I? Because, yeah, this is just going to refill me on stars anyway. Oh yeah, and there's no red coins up here, so I can just ignore those. There we go, deflection shots. And this is why this level is so insane, is because we're always on unsteady platforms while dodging a barrage of all sorts of garbage. <laughs> I got this... Oh, oh, oh. 
<laughs> and the toadies. They do not make things easy. <laughs> oh, okay, there we go. I know I need to get that other one, but I just want to get... Well, I got the one in the, in the tree, by mistake. Remember the one that was way up at the top of the tree behind the... Uh, behind the canopy, that when the canopy moves, you can see it. Yeah, I got that one with the seed. And you got him off. And now there's still that other shy guy that's gonna appear on that other side. So, what I'm gonna do here is try and rush on ahead. And... Gr oh, yes! And I got that flower, too. <laughs> okay. I just jumped on the shy guy really quickly, if you can tell. That's how I got that hover boost. But yeah, okay, now I can go back and go get this. Because this is this would have been a waste to get if I didn't get that other whoops, if I didn't get that other one. I could also do that by ground pounding that post, but details. <laughs> I want there's probably something important with that coin. Oh no, there is not. Okay. Um a lot of eggs. A lot of eggs. Give me the egg girls. Oh, don't fall off the Oh, you did <laughs> That's that thing I was talking about when you are next to the edge of a platform when you take a hit when you're recovering. Sometimes the momentum kinda knocks you off the edge. It's it's kinda sad. <laughs> I'm kind of tempted not even to bother to go to that secret area and just use a plus 10 stars or something like that just to speed things along, but yeah, know, we'll see. Um, you know, I wonder if I should even bother with the watermelons. I mean, they are sort of handy to an extent, but I think the eggs are more handy because of their deflection properties. No! Oh, backwards! Frickin' carousel! <laughs> That is such a tricky jump. Well, I should say it's a tricky series of jumps, because you gotta go low, and you, it's very touchy on the... Oh! On the good control, I guess you can say. Because, well, it, it, it just said you gotta be very precise on it. It's, <laughs> you get what I'm saying. Alright, so... Recollect. Boop. Eat. Boop. And go! Okay. Uh, I'll eventually get the hang of this carousel again. Oh! Okay. <laughs> got an egg out of that, too. No extra watermelon. Pound that. Grab the star. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Okay. <laughs> I licked him off screen. And we're good. Woo! Now, um. I should probably. Get that monkey. Yeah! Okay. <laughs> Starting to get that nice and good. It's, oh, shoot. That was not. That toady keeps Baby Mario from homing back in on me. <laughs> oh, jeez. And when you get hit when you don't have Baby Mario on your back, you sort of have more of a uh, kickback effect, too. So that's another thing about this level, is that there's a. If you don't have Baby Mario on your back, you are even in even more trouble than you were before, if you can actually believe that. <laughs> okay. Watermelon is pretty handy there. Now. Now, this shy guy. Oh! That was a good jump. Oh, that was a bad move. <laughs> oh, shoot! Shoot! <laughs> It's such a short level, but it's so hard. Like, you see how much I'm collecting in such a short amount of time, right? And if you don't get that red coin as it's falling from the Shy Guy, like like you just seen there, it's gonna go straight into the pit. Because there's absolutely nothing below that. That's why I just basically go for that red coin as high priority. <laughs> Alrighty. Eat. Move on. Hover! Oh, do some! <laughs> do some tricky platforming and fall into the pits. Man! Man! <laughs> like, this le level could literally be done in just a few minutes. Like, two or three minutes if you. if everything goes just right. <laughs> but the chances of that are not in your favor. <laughs> 
it's very, very hard to execute. Like, there's, there really isn't anything luck-based to it, per se. It's just very, very difficult. <laughs> no. Oh, I ate the toady and not popped the bait. Mm. <laughs> Dang it. And I ended up plopping in there because I wasn't doing what I was expecting to be doing with my body. <laughs> Maybe I'm just getting impatient at this point, too. But... But... I have stars to collect, monkeys to eat, 100%ing to do. <laughs> okay. This jump is still insane, <laughs> especially with that monkey shooting its seeds along the way. Well, um, uh, come on, come on, come on, come on! I can't, I can't go down there. <laughs> I just could not go down there at all. I hope you understand that, baby. <laughs> uh, let's recover some of our stars, I guess. I think I accidentally dropped the uh, baby bubble by hitting it with a watermelon seed, because when you shoot the bubble out of the air, it drops down from where it is. So, yeah. Alright. Uh, wait a second. Okay. Uh, careful, careful, careful. Very, very careful. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ooh! Ah, I wasn't paying attention above me. There's so many projectiles, too. That's another thing. About this level, okay. Let's go back. I don't remember if there are any red coins here, okay. I don't want to burn all my magnifying glasses, basically. <laughs> then I'll have to go and try and grind them. And there we go. Got that. And, okay. Now, Shy Guy time. Oh shoot! Yes, I got it. All right, I'll I'll take that. <laughs> okay, now I can go ahead and do this stuff normally, ish. <laughs> oh, did I ever get that coin in the treetops? I think I did. I think. Here, give me a boost. <laughs> Yeah, I think I got it, because it was in that monkey seed section. And I, I think it just got hit by a seed at some point. Alright. <sighs> Let's just skip this a little bit slow. Okay. And we're off. We are good to go, still. I should take care of that monkey, though, somehow. <laughs> okay. Ground pound this to give me extra amounts of eggs. Alrighty. Give me a red coin up there. This is looking good for a run-ish. Okay. Oop, well. Uh, basically what you want to do here is knock the shy guys off the carousel. But uh, that's kind of... It's, it's target practice. <laughs> You're on a moving platform, they're on a moving platform. Okay, I cleared it all off. You can just slurp them up as you going onto the platform, but that's a little tricky because chances are another Shy Guy is going to jump, I mean, it's, it's you're going to flutter into a Shy Guy that's coming down on top of you, basically. Okay. And, oh yeah, that's right. There's those guys. <laughs> but, 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 don't think I am going to forget... Oh, I did have a plus 20 there. Don't think... I am going to forget for a second here. Wait, actually, how did I get so many of those star items? I wasn't paying attention, I didn't even have to do that bonus game, did I? <laughs> well, at the very least, I showed what bonus game it was and how to get items from it. One hundred percent! I don't think I'm going to do any cuts in this video because... I, I, like, I could just show you the, the finishing run, but... I don't think that'll really give you an idea as to how difficult this level is. <laughs> so I, I'll probably just end up putting a timestamp or something in the video saying, hey, if you if you want to see the winning run, 
go to this or in the description or something like that. And there we go. World 3 is as 100%ed as I possibly can get it. Heck yeah. I think I was actually getting a lot of stars from this, come to think of it. I just wasn't using as many as I thought I was. Uh, so, okay, I just want that plus 20. Maybe the magnifying glasses. Maybe the full eggs. We shall see how, how much I remember here. There we go. <laughs> that was one magnifying glass, and then the other one was here. I for oh, shoot, that wasn't... Oh, shoot, 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 that wasn't correct. Was it this one? That was... Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Well, <laughs> alas, alas. I got my stars, though, so I'm happy. <laughs> And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when I begin World 4. <sighs> More monkey madness is crazy. 